Coming up next, it's a UFC light heavyweight division encounter. Are back for more here tonight, and he's so comfortable in the striking realm. It's almost like he started kickboxing before he ever was reading or writing. Oh, it's unbelievable to see someone that's so comfortable under so much duress. I know. When you're in kickboxing range, you are in the fire. There is no safety. You're right in range to be getting knocked out, but he does not fear that. He loves it. He loves the he loves the combat. He loves the engagement. But what you have to understand is not engaging his opponents on their terms. He's doing it on his terms. Whether or not he wants to be in close with the big punches or he wants to be at range landing kicks, he's just constantly putting damage on you. Top, bottom, up, low, it does not matter. This guy is a dominant striker. One of the best kickboxers the UFC has ever seen. And in terms of the punching technique and the jab, as good as anyone in this division. All right, so here he is, UFC light heavyweight champion times two. Future Hall of Famer, a man you know as well as anyone in DC, Johnny Bones Jones. John Jones is one of those talents that when you see him for the first time, you understand that he is something special. He has a very strong mind, unbelievable skill set, and an ability to rise to the occasion. He did it from the moment he first stepped foot in the octagon as a very young fighter to his long championship reign. Some of the victims on John Jones' resume is unbelievable to have beat that many UFC champions over the course of his career. John Jones truly is one of the greatest martial artists of all time. Skill for skill, one of the best fighters you will ever see, and very loyal when it comes to his team. He has been with Mike Winkle, John, and Greg Jackson since day one. John Jones trying to add to arguably the greatest mixed martial arts legacy the sport has ever seen here and now tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of nine wins, no losses. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 199 pounds. Fighting out of London, England, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a look see do fighter, holding a professional record of 28 wins, one loss, and one no contest. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, USA, ladies and gentlemen, he is the former UFC light heavyweight world champion, John Bones Jones! Ready? You ready to fight? All right, here we go with round one, his knockout streak. Whoa! That was straight to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> oh, straight right. Oh, no! Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this? Jones, and he is fighting with a definite killer instinct here tonight. And you have to have it, because the target's always on your back when you're the UFC champion. Jones seems desperate to keep that title wrapped around the books. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this jump. Good body shot. And now he's got that tie clinch. All right, we'll so now he's over the ground. Now he is in his wheelhouse. We'll see if he can get one of his submissions to pop here tonight. Side control now. Just over three minutes to go. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. What a punch. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. And that one certainly found the target. Right, single collar tie now. Oh, brutal knee to the body. Massive head kick. Both guys landing at a pretty decent level. over the top. This fight's gonna be over. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He 
up there, gain some valuable separation. And now, the ground and pound starts. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Strike lands there, and somehow, his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. He's got to cut above the eye now. Oh, nice punch there by Jones. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. And oh! He's hurt. He's hurt bad. Well, he's up, but oh, is he hurt. Big knee to the body! So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, but we're going to get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moment, you got to show up, and that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Gaines called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 44 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by Knockout Assassin. So the celebration.